We encountered an electric vehicle lithium battery that quickly charges to full but runs out of power shortly after. To identify the issue, we disassembled this battery pack. During the disassembly, we found that the battery had used its patch cells, and the welding process involved the spark welding machine. After disassembling the battery, we need to check the voltage of each cell. Typically, in such cases, more than 80% of the issues are related to the cells. Therefore, we need to remove the protection board and measure the voltage of each cell through the protection board's connectors. The measurement result showed that the 13 cells' voltage was too low, only to point for volts, while the nominal voltage for the other cells was around for 0.15 volts. It was evident that the 13th cell had a problem. Next, we need to further inspect the cell to determine if a cell has an issue. We can observe its appearance and measure its internal resistance. The normal cell's internal resistance was about 1.5 million. While the 40 cells' internal resistance was over 20 million. In such cases, using a balancer won't solve the fundamental problem. This battery pack consists of 14 cells. This battery pack consists of 14 cells. So we decided to remove the 40 13 cell and use it as a 13 cell pack. We prepared a 13-cell lithium battery protection board and started soldering the protection board's ribbon cable. Using a comprehensive testing instrument, We check the soldering sequence of the ribbon cable, confirming that the current number of cells is 13, with each cell voltage around for 0.15 volts, indicating no issues with the soldering. Next, we fixed and connected the protection board. And finally, pack the battery. The lithium battery repair was thus completed. 